Welcome to another edition of Small Talk for You. This morning I wanted to go through something we ran across upgrading from VisualWorks 7.6 to 7.9.1 and actually you'd hit this as early as 7.8 if you were coming from 7.6 and that's something like this. Here you have in code 2 at negative 1 so that's supposed to be a point which you're probably going to use to move something around on screen or move the relative position of something. It's not really a point you want to put in Cartesian space exactly. But you go ahead and inspect this in 7.6 notice you get a point. Pretty much what you expect. In 7.9.1 or 7.8 and up, it turns out that at minus is a legal binary message. It didn't used to be, so notice what happens when I try it here. I get this exception. We had a few places where we were using that kind of thing as translation, and to fix it, what you need to do is something rather basic. You come in here and put spaces around this, and suddenly everything works the way you expect again. You get your translation point, and you're all good again. Same kind of thing happens here. 1 slash minus, again, they expanded the way the possible legal binary messages. So here, slash minus, not understood. In 7.6, you get negative 1, as you'd expect in that version. So keep in mind that they expanded the range of legal binary messages. If you have this kind of thing in 7.9.1 or 7.8 and up, really, you're going to have to do this kind of thing, put spaces around everything to make sure they're understood. You can use the refactoring tool, refactoring browsers, rewrite tool to go ahead and fix that for you. Just hunt down all the references and do them. I've done screencasts on doing that kind of rewrite, so just look that up if you're unsure how to do it. But in any case, it's easy to find all the senders of at minus or slash minus. You can just use the browser tools to find that. And then go ahead and fix them all either by hand or with the rewrite tool if you've got too many. So it's better for today. Until next time, have fun with whatever small talk you're using.